How's it? IndianCowboy.Sports.com coming right on Sunday, November the 3rd, as we get this video to you around this time. I hope you checked out my football video. I put that up for you on Friday. It has all my football leans. Uh, remember, I do a daily video every day, but just on Wednesday, I have started to do a football roundup for you. Just only a football video. That's the video that's in detail about football. I will give you a summary on football at the end of this video, but that is my daily video because we still got to talk about NBA and college basketball and hockey and all of those games, right? So that's what we're going to do today. But um, hello, I'm Indian Cowboy, and this is Doc Sports. And Cowboy has been around for a cool 19 years, and Doc Sports has been around for 53 years. How this works is our best selections are over at DocSports.com under Rune Shiva. Our next best selections are our, uh, our free picks and leans, which is the video that you're watching right now. I have a doctor and a master's in biostatistics. That's how these algorithms work. Welcome to my free daily podcast. Again, our best selections are over at Doc Sports under Indian Cowboy. You know where our next best selections are at, which is on this video. We have a popular YouTube premium teaching channel for $20 a month. We come at you on a live show every single day from Monday through Sunday at night. Uh, usually 10 games or about 300 games all for just $20 a month. And it is a recorded podcast. You can re-listen at any time. And uh, you get a summary at the end, uh, a verbal summary, but also a written summary at the end as well. Awesome value, one of the best deals on the internet. And many of those selections turn out to be, or several of those selections ter- turn out to be premium selections the next day. So it's just incredible value. Um... Turn out to be premium. Yeah, so it's just um, incredible value. Uh, normally, that live shows around 9 p.m. Eastern, but sometimes at 10 p.m. Eastern. But I will come at you live tonight at around 10 p.m. Eastern, probably, okay? And uh, that is an important live show, and uh, we will start getting into a rhythm of that today and every day going forward, okay? The link to YouTube Premium is in the comment section, as well as the link to how to get to free $60 of the premium selections. If you want more content, be sure to check my Twitter. It has our latest updates, our hot takes on sports, and our latest videos are posted there. So what do I need to tell you? Well, we won a huge eight-unit uh, college football selection yesterday. Great win on SMU, routing Pittsburgh 48-25. to We also won our six-unit soccer selection. We also won our hockey selection. We are 2-0 and in football. The two football plays we had yesterday, SMU rolled and also Ole Miss rolled. Ole Miss rolled big, 63-31 to or something. We won our two football plays yesterday by 46 points, I think. We have three football selections today, including a six-unit NFL at 4 o'clock and two other NFL selections. Jump on both of them. We have a great shot at going 5-0 and this week. We're already 2-0 plus 1,200. We're pretty sure we're about to have a winning week in football unless I lose all three selections. But, um, you know, two, uh, a six-unit selection at 4 o'clock, another four-unit at 4 o'clock, and another uh, four-unit at 1 o'clock. So I can't wait for you to join us in all the football card. All right? Seven-unit NBA today at 3.30, and that's going to win, so be sure to jump on that as well. All right? So let it be football. Let it be NBA. Um, all of that is on the horizon, which is great. Okay, so once let me check something real fast here. That's odd. Hmm. Huh, okay. I'll work on that later. Uh, but yeah, so looking forward to that. All right, let's get your free play winner today. And uh, yeah, your free play winner today is going to be on... Uh, I'm going to go through this pretty fast, okay, because I think... I want to get this video out there. Um, I'm also, yeah, let me get this video out to you fast here. Okay, yeah. Did I tell you everything I need to tell you? Yep. Uh, the link, by the way, be sure to jump on our YouTube premium. It's in the comment section uh, if you want the link to that. If you want even more content, be sure to check my Twitter. It has our latest updates, hot takes on sports, and our latest videos are posted there. And uh, that's about it. And uh, I already told you to join us for our um, football, college basketball, NBA. College basketball starts in two days. And we're expecting a plus 5,000 season just like we did in the WNBA, plus 5,600. Um, daily props, MMA, golf, soccer, NHL, horse racing, NBA, college basketball, football. Your free play today. I like the Dallas Cowboys, plus the three. I think they're going to beat my Atlanta Falcons. And uh, so I'm going to go with them. Dallas plus the three here. Look, I don't trust my Atlanta Falcons at all. Dallas is in absolute desperate mood here. If they don't win this game, they're toast. And they know that. They're 3-4. and four. Atlanta's 5-3. and three. Um, The last time these two teams played each other in 2021, Dallas won 43-3. But Dallas comes off back-to-back losses. And to their credit, they haven't lost three in a row a year. Are we going to really be mad at Dallas because they lost to San Francisco by six and lost to the Lions? You know, it's hard to be mad at them when they lose to two above 500 teams like San Fran and Detroit. Let's not forget, this team still beat Pittsburgh on the road. This team still beat the Giants. They were only three points of a loss to the Ravens. Um, you know, so I actually like Dallas here. And I, you know, Atlanta's fine. I mean, I'm a huge Falcons fan. They beat the Bucks, whoop de doo They lost to Seattle by 20. They beat Carolina, whoop de doo They beat the Bucks again, whoop de doo They beat the Saints, whoop de doo 
they were tight against Kansas City, and they did beat Philadelphia on the road, but Philadelphia can be sketch. I'm going to go with Dallas plus a three. That is your free play winner. Um, some quick thoughts for you. I still think that in the NBA, by the way, I like the Hawks to get it done over New Orleans. Atlanta's lost, what, four straight in a row. I think they have to bounce back at some point. So I like Atlanta here. I think they bounce back here against New Orleans. New Orleans comes off a pair of wins, I believe. They think they come off a huge win against Indiana. Indiana. Yeah, I think they have a huge letdown. Um, so give me the Hawks. Lean on the Atlanta Hawks there. Orlando and Dallas, lean on the over there in the NBA. I think Orlando can be an active dog and send this game over the post to total. Still no Benchero with that abdomen injury. Um, and I think Dallas comes off a nice win, but they're not going to play great defense against Orlando. I like Orlando being an active dog and send this game over the post to total. As far as the rest, here let me quickly go through all the other nfl i lean on the chargers today i've already talked about this i think the browns will have a letdown after the last win um and with Jameis and the chargers coming off of a loss so lean on the chargers i lean on the bengals losing by 20 points is tough um you know but uh, i think that uh, at the end of the day cincinnati needs this game much much more than vegas does so lean on the bengals again go back to my friday video my football roundup video it has all of this and i'll put that link on the bottom but i'll quickly run through it again for you tennessee patriots i still lean on tennessee um, I think they're favored for a reason. Brissett only threw for 130 yards. I don't trust Patriots at all after that Jets win. Washington Giants, I lean on the over there. I think um, you know, Washington 18 points in their last game. The Giants, Washington, when they faced each other last time, was 21-18. to 18, But the Giants had so many chances to score, and they didn't. Uh, Daniels threw for 330 yards in his last game, and Caleb only threw for 130 yards. And Washington still didn't put up a lot of points. I think they will this game. New Orleans, Carolina. I like Carolina, and I like the over. Remember last time uh, New Orleans beat this team 47-10. to 10. Carolina has a lot of revenge. Bryce actually played pretty well last game. Rattler was still struggling overall. Give me Carolina, a small lean on the over. Miami, Buffalo, I lean on the over there. Buffalo has won this game the last three times. Um, Miami can still be an active dog. I wouldn't be surprised if Miami is an active dog to send this game over. Again, detailed football video for you on the Thursday video, but I'm just quickly doing it for you anyway. Here, Detroit Green Bay, I lean on the under there still. Green Bay's off of a loss. Detroit coming off a huge win. Detroit, whenever they face elite tendencies, have a tendency to struggle. Green Bay, I think when they when they are a small dog, they have a tendency to play to the under. Rams, Seattle, I like the Rams. I think Seattle's really struggling here. Aren't you fascinated? The Rams are favored on the road to begin with. I don't want to go Giants. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I lean on the Rams. Indianap Indianapolis, Minnesota, I lean on the under. I think it's shady that Minnesota's only favored by three or so coming off back-to-back -back losses. I think they play fantastic defense. Vikings defense giving up 30 points in back-to-back -back games. And Indianapolis now is going to rally behind Joe Flacco. And I think they play quality defense and ball control type game, especially with Richardson not playing. So look for the under there. Finally, Tampa Bay, Kansas City. I like the under there. Look, I can't take the Bucks because they come off a pair of losses. I can't take the Chiefs uh, because it just because the Bucks are absolutely desperate. Um, so I think the best way to go here is the Todd Bowles defense. I think they step up here and play against the city. Wouldn't be surprised if that game goes under the post total. That's what I have for you guys. Hope you guys are doing great. Please take a moment to like and subscribe, and I'll see you back here tomorrow. Indian Cow, working hard for you every single day.